Gypsy Blues. When I'm not playing in some blues club in Chicago, I'm watching Eric C. on YouTube because you never know what or who you might see. Please subscribe to Eric C. He's a good friend of mine and he's a great guy. Thanks. Later. Hey, what's going on everybody another unboxing to do all right so this is the Dell Precision M6800 that I did a bunch of upgrades on for my father and uh, he's really loving this computer it's a lot quicker than what this thing was uh, I ended up taking the other computer that was sitting on the shelf over there and stripping out basically the hard drive the cd-rom drive it's a dvd burner and also um the memory out of it so i turned this thing into eight gigs i put an ssd hard drive in there and there's really not much more i could do with it uh i can buy another processor for this thing i found out that i can match up a um a little bit faster of a cpu but uh yeah i'm not even going to bother with it so this is good enough for the kid right now. It fires up a lot faster than what it did before. Uh, this puppy here has been a very good computer for me. This is the Dell Precision M6500. But I got another M6800 right there in the box. Hey, great people of YouTube. How's it going? Hope everyone's doing well out there. It's been a while. It's been a while since I watched some of your guys' videos. Don't worry, I will be catching up soon with them. I'm going to end up having some free time coming along soon, I hope. Um, I got to give a big thanks out to Electric Gypsy Blues for that intro. You guys are going to be listening to some of his music throughout this video. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I have. So thanks a lot, Gypsy. Uh, you know, great playing, man. Uh, so let's get on to what this video is going to be about. So from the beginning of this video, um, you saw I brought in a pretty large package. Well, in that package is another laptop. In fact, it is another M6800 uh, Dell Precision workhorse. And... Uh, Basically, what I'm going to do is replace the computer that I've been, the laptop that I've been using for the past five or six years now, which has been a great de uh, desktop laptop, basically, because I've been using it as a desktop instead of just, you know, using it as a portable laptop. The CPU on this one here, my uh, 6500, is basically a uh, 2.13 gigahertz, um, 8 it's showing eight physical CPUs on this thing, running Windows 7 uh, Professional. And uh, memory's pretty good on this. This has got the quad core extreme inside of it. Uh, it's been a great computer, laptop, whatever you want to call it. 
Uh, but I'm kind of wanting something that's going to be a little bit more, more faster and a little bit more newer without spending a whole shitload of money doing it. Now, my father's laptop is the M6800. I put a quad core i7 inside of it and uh, more memory, better uh, SSD drive instead of using the regular disk hard drives. So I end up picking up basically the same thing, but without having to do most of the upgrades. Now, the CPU in the 6800 that I picked up um, is basically the same CPU that I installed in my father's PC or laptop. And uh, basically I'm waiting for a solid state drive to come in so I can clone over what's on that drive and stick it inside. So, so I have a mess to clean up over here as far as more computer shit. I've been working on the HP. I took one HP and uh, combined it and made a better HP out of it. But, um, you know, the kid's computer is fast enough for what she's going to use it for. Not fast enough for what I'm going to use it for. So let's get, uh, I guess, unboxing? No? All right, so here's the box. It's a little bit on the large side for a laptop so let's get very well packed two pillows of bagged styrofoam nice thing to have is a power supply and here she is this one is in pristine shape. I mean, like, no scratches, no dents, besides my fingerprints on it now. Um, yeah. This also has the drive where the drawer doesn't come out, which I kind of like that. And there she is. Basically a carbon copy of that one, but with the CPU already upgrade, I don't have to do a thing with it. So I'm going to probably start firing this thing up shortly uh, i do however want to take off the back cover i do want to upgrade the memory inside of it i do have two sticks of memory um i don't have 32 gigs And again, the 6500 that I've been using has been a great PC. These are workstation PCs or workhorses. Um, they're meant to um, you know, be put under pressure and uh, they've been great. Now the one that I have that I currently am using, that's going to be put away. I'm not going to wipe the hard drive. I'm not going to do anything with it besides just shut it down, close it up and put it away. It'll be a backup. In case something ever happens, I need another one.